How we going guys, the Loot Gamer over here and welcome to another episode of upcoming Collector's Editions over here guys, as we can see we get the Nintendo Switch Diablo 3 Limited Edition console switch over here and as you can see these are pretty expensive price points fellas, we're looking at 559 Australian dollars, that is so damn expensive, a $50 deposit required as we can see coming out on the 2nd of November 2018 over there and as we can see over there in case you guys wanted to just grab the game that cost you $89.95 the same price as a PS4 game so you're getting yourself the full Diablo experience on a lovely switch over here and of course if you guys wanted to get that on PS4 that'll cost you 80 Australian dollars and Xbox one 79.95 I wonder why you know switch games are more expensive than PS4 games I really really wanted that fellas but let me know in the comments below why you think that is the case so of course guys February the second on the second of November coming down as you said earlier $50 deposit let's have a look and see exactly what goodies we get over here so of course this switch is looking really awesome I kind of wish they sort of added a bit more color to this collector's edition because I feel as though it's a bit fraying and a bit frail honestly guys gray and black uh, I, I don't know what i think about that but looking at the screenshots looking really awesome as we as we just saw the video right now play and i'm looking forward to seeing how that looks like and let's just uh, go back and sort of see what we get but of course let's just check this out now Pretty cool. Oh, interesting. So two people can play. That's cool. That looks pretty badass guys so of course as we can see there it does support multiple players playing the game which is so cool i'm pretty impressed to actually see that but of course as we know over there is, as you can see the eternal collection there and of course this is how the switch will look like looks pretty much okay i kind of do wish they put color but this obviously comes with a really nice pouch there as we can see the diablo pouch i really like the way that detail looks over there with a the nice different color zipping over there which is cool so of course we get the bundle there which comes with the game of course with the console of course itself and I really do like that they really put you know a lot of attention to detail especially with the images here and from what I could see we're able to have about four players playing at the same time so this is really nice so you would definitely be enjoying the full Diablo experience on your switch over here let me know whether you guys will be picking this up because I'm finding this pretty interesting but honestly guys I don't think I'll be getting a switch as of yet but let me know what you guys think of this but I really do think it's pretty awesome and these graphics are looking pretty awesome too so I'm really excited to, to sort of see what they would do with this Diablo game itself but let's go down now and see exactly what we get so this bundle includes the Nintendo Switch Diablo 3 console of course the eternal collection so the full game download of course and freedom to have fun all that good stuff there so this comes with the Nintendo Switch console Nintendo Switch dock left and right Joy-Con controller Joy-Con grip Joy-Con strap and so on probably the normal stuff that we usually get but I would say the most important thing that we want to know most importantly what it comes with, 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 with which is of course the game itself and the console but of course if you guys just wanted to get the game alone that'll be $89.99 with a $10 deposit this time and of course you know the full Diablo experience itself so let me know what you guys would do. Would you guys recommend getting this? Would you guys even get it for yourselves? Or would you guys just pass? Especially if y'all already have it on PC. I see no reason to get it. But in case you guys don't have a PC and you always wanted to play Diablo, I would definitely recommend getting it. So the Eternal Collection will be 80 bucks on PS4. That will be dropping. It's actually right now. It's actually available now. As you guys know, it's an old game. But it's really nice to see. But I kind of wish they had the Reapers of Souls. So it says here, yeah, uh, Diablo game, Reapers of Souls expansion, the Rise of the Necromancer pack. That's also involved in this. But I'm kind of curious to see whether this Rise of the Necromancer will be sort of available with this bundle. Let's have a look. 
And from what I see, I don't see that available, guys. So maybe it is, but they're not necessarily uh, sort of confirming that it is available. So looking at this for the Xbox One, of course, that's $79.95 over there too. So, you know, the same price point as the PS4. So that also does, of course, come with the Reaper of Souls expansion and also the Rise of the Necromancer Pack too. But that over there, guys, is the Diablo Switch Limited Edition console. What do you guys think about it? Most importantly, would you guys be, be, be buying this? I reckon it's a really good purchase, but... You know, the fact that I have Diablo on my PC, I don't think I'll be getting a Switch just to switch towards a Switch, if that makes any sense per se. But that over there, guys, is Diablo coming out on the 2nd of November. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I am the Loot Gamer, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the